so the difference between capital G and small g in relation to gravitation. So we are familiar with Newton's universal law of gravitation which states that if there are two objects let's say of mass m1 and m2 separated by a small distance or any distance small r so there is a gravitational force of attraction between them and that gravitational force is equal to F is equal to capital G M1 M2 divided by R square. So here the capital G is equal to the universal gravitational constant. It is a proportionality constant and it has a value equals to g is equal to 6.67 into 10 to the power minus 11 newton meter square kg to the power minus 2 in si and 6.67 into 10 to the power minus 8 dyne centimeter square gram to the power minus 2 in cgs whereas small g it is acceleration due to gravity it is the acceleration with which an object freely falling downwards under earth's gravitational pull it experiences under free fall so the value of small g that is equal to near the surface of the earth it is 9.8 meter per second square okay and it is equal to small g is equal to capital g capital m by r square so here capital G as we know it is the universal gravitational constant capital M is the mass of the earth and capital R is radius of the earth so it is only for here for the sake of simplicity I am assuming that the object is near the surface of the earth and it has a value 9.8 meter per second square now the difference between capital G and small g so capital G is a proportionality constant it is acceleration due to gravity capital G has a fixed value whereas the value of acceleration due to gravity it can be you know variable depending upon various factors